All right, uh, the last set of questions that you have five of is exponential growth again. So it's the same formula as before. Uh, this time, uh, even though you would do the same thing with your, if it, if, it, if it grew by a certain amount every five years or every 10 years, and you were given a number of years that have passed, you would do the same thing as before. All of these questions though that you're getting in this last set of five um, it's per year, and you're giving a number of years, so you're just dividing by one, which has uh, no effect. So, um, actually, I'm going to leave that so that you have, um, let me duplicate this so I can use it later, and I can post that maybe. But right now, for these types of questions, you just have something kind of like uh, this. Um, okay, so in this case, uh, we're growing by a percentage. Um, where 1 represents 100%, and 9% would represent 0 0.09. Well, this thing, you don't lose anything, um, so we don't want to know what, we're not cutting down to 9%, we're increasing our original amount, our 100% of our original amount, by 9%. So, um, so you can read the question, the fox population in a certain region has an annual growth rate of 9% per year, it is estimated that the population in the year 2000 was uh, 166,000. Um, give it as a function of time. Okay, so boom. Uh, our population will be, after t years, uh, the 166,000. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, it's uh, 16,600. Uh, yeah. I read that wrong, times um, an increase of 9%. That means you have your original 100%, 1, and then you add 9% to that. So 1.09 is your factor. So you're going to take your percentage and you're going to add that as a decimal to 1. You don't want to lose your original 16,600. You just want to increase that by 9%. So you're going to do 1.09 for a 9% growth per year. All right, so after T years, you just put a T here. And that's all you gotta do. Um, after eight years, you just put an eight here. And in that case, you're gonna need your calculator. Uh, here we go. Um, 1.09 raised to the eight times 16,600. Uh, we get 33,076, and that's what you will put, 33,076. Uh, so the, this is how you do um, these three types of problems. Uh, hopefully this is easy, and you guys don't have any issue with it. Um, I should be back soon, so uh, have a great day.